Yo, what's up? So I just got an email, said that my package was delivered, so let's see what we got. Looks like we got something out there. Just got a package in, not X. Said, like I said, we just got a package in, not X Ashamar. See what we got going on here. Let's see what kind of fire we got. So right off the bat, I do like the fact that he uh, sent them in boxes instead of plastic bags. I know I've gotten a few hats and they were just weren't packaged that great. So let's see what we got inside here real quick. Let's see if I can do this one handed. Nope. That's a definite no. guys here we go I blew them up told him to customize my order doesn't look like he got any of those obviously not so it's not bad not too bad stitching's good stitching's quality as you can see those look like got a little deformed here you can tell there I don't know if that was from shipping or if that was from stitching, but as you can see, check out the inside. So, you know, he did sit there and pick out some of that paper, but not all of it. I'm assuming how many orders he got. Who knows? Let's see what we got going on down here. Yeah, there's more paper down there. But all in all, I mean... Quality's there. It's got a few little stragglers, as you can see. Let's see if it's going to pick that up. Well, anyway. Right here in Pikachu's face, there's a couple little stragglers. You can see them. Uh, this Pikachu looks pretty on point. A couple little stragglers there, too. Looks like I could burn off. Other than that, this is the Thunderstruck. By Nodex Ashamar. Don't get me wrong, they are a little bit pricey. I think I got this one for 120, 120 bucks. And I mean, granted, you're paying for pretty much the logos because these hats are like 35 bucks, 40 bucks at the most. So you're not really paying too much for the hat, you're really paying more for that customization. But all in all, I mean, it doesn't look too bad. Like I said, it is a little deformed, a little crooked. I don't know if that's just because the stitching or what's going on there, but let's see, I'll throw it on for you guys and see what we've got going on. So right off the bat, I mean, it's not too bad. It's all right, fitment's good. Probably should have ordered the next size up just because of that stitching there. But I mean, it still fits, of course, it's a little tight. Not too, too, too bad. A fucking haircut. Like I said, the only thing that's kind of really bothering me about it is this bump up right here. And that has to be from the stitching. There's no way. There's no way that that's not. Because I've never had a hat. Well, I mean, just for instance. So just for instance, pink bottom. Obviously, same exact thing. The only thing that's different is this is a... Uh, because this is the Three River Stadium, the Three Golden Decades. Obviously, you can see, you know, this one's a lot looser. Fits me a lot better. I do leave my brim, my brim straight because, you know, we're back in the 90s still. Take the stickers off. No stickers on that shit. But, I mean, obviously, you can tell the difference right off the bat. That's a big old bump right here. That's the only thing that's kind of really bothering me about it. But other than that, I mean, it's not too bad. I think I'd still rock the pink bottom over it, to be completely honest. You should let me know what you guys think. Pink bottom. We got Thunderstruck, Pikachu. Let me know. Leave your comments. Like I said, this bump is kind of killing it for me. But hopefully, let's see if I can iron that out. I still got to pull the stickers off of this one, obviously. I don't know what all stickers are on it. That one for sure. But let's see what's going on. Shout out to Nodex. You know, Nodex Ashima. 
course, that's all his custom work. I bought this hat with my own money. Like I said, I blew up all his comments, told him that, told him to throw a little custom piece on it, but obviously he didn't see that. But let me know what you guys think. Would you guys buy it or not?